All right, we are in Shanakale, our first uh, full day here, and we are going to go see the ruins of the city of Troy and the museum that they have there. We just watched a video on it, so we'll have a better idea of what we're looking at, right? We're gonna go get in our car. Yeah. We don't have to walk or go on the metro or <laughs> bus. And get something. Boat. I know it's Boat. such a luxury. Such a luxury. I know it's super random. There's cars. Yeah. It said it was open on the They like post COVID makes everything so much weirder. Turns out the city of Troy and there's a guy going down right there. Is that dead body? No. <laughs> oh look at that sweet heart. Ollie was free because he's seven and under. And so for the rest of us, four tickets, it was $30 US total for the museum and for the archeological site, which is awesome. That shows the layers, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, nine. They're saying that that could have been it because that would be the one that makes sense standard-wise. No. no. One, two, three, four, five, six is the red. Oh. And seven is the green. That's the era, they said. Yeah, six. So the red one. Could be the era of the yeah, Trojan War. They said, but it looks like it didn't get ruined. Like, ruined by an army, Go. but by an earthquake. <laughs> This one. This guy looks like a, um, <laughs> a garden gnome from the first century BC. They show how um, these bowls were made. We were talking about how when we went to the pottery village in Hoi An and saw the people doing the pottery. Very, very similar. It hasn't really changed. They found it in 1998. Whoa, that's crazy. And from what time period? Uh, fourth century. The fourth century BC? Uh, yes. Wow. That's probably why, because they have to go further and further down. Yeah. The older it gets. Wow, that's incredible. That's that is, mm -hmm. wow. Crazy. That's amazing. So this morning we were watching on a video about Troy and it talked about this guy named Schleiman, Schleiman, and he was the first person to come and excavate the site, but what was he doing there? Uh, he was just blowing it up with fire light, just was? to find, because uh, he was a treasure hunter, so all he was doing was to find diamonds and gold and stuff. So he blasted through the site, which ruined a bunch of it. Then he ended up stealing a bunch of the artifacts and in fact not and not giving them to the turkish people he was taking them back to athens mm -hmm. and they actually had a court case against him in the 1870s and won but he wouldn't tell them where the treasures were hidden and then he just kept stealing stuff from the sites oh, yeah. pretty interesting and then he died, and he died. the end so they have all of these holograms that show you what people would have been doing. This is that one. Oh, yeah. Pretty cool. Oh, that's neat technology, huh? Oh, Homer. Mm -hmm. Do you remember who Homer was, Clay? Yes, yeah, he wrote about stuff. Yeah. Stuff. <laughs> he wrote about stuff. Daddy said he was the father of Bart. 
Not Simpsons. Oh, Daddy. Jesus, Dad. Don't be ridiculous. Statue of Aphrodite in the first century. <laughs> Look at all these statues. Mike and I just keep saying to each other, we can't believe we're the only people here. No we haven't problem. seen a single person here the entire time we've been here. And it is a, oh, massive. Ollie just pointed out a security, security guard. <laughs> <laughs> it's massive, a beautiful museum. It's like six stories. It has artifacts dating back to like fifth or sixth century BC. There's like tons of Roman statues. It's like, if you were in Rome, anywhere that had this many, or in America, anywhere that had this many artifacts, there'd be seven million school-age kids and a ton of tourists. It's incredible. If you want to see artifacts or you're into Greek or Roman mythology and ancient history, go to Turkey. It's cheap and nobody's here. Another reason you should go here is it has really interactive things for kids because it has like a matching game, they had uh, like a mix and match of characters game and like a face one. Choose a face. Whichever one you want. I do this one. Okay. And okay, then well, your get face. your face into it. Now you gotta move that. And then. Perfect. <laughs> that was perfect. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then you, you do the QR code and then it's in dad's phone. Isn't that funny? There's lots of fun. And they have the holographs. I know, I yeah. was very impressed with the technology. Yeah, no, it's really cool. It is a really nice museum. Mm -hmm. That's what these pictures are, huh? This is all the pictures in here of all the stuff yeah. that was stolen and that they there. haven't gotten back. That's interesting. So, if you go to the museum first like we did, then you do want to drive down. It's like four minutes further down the street to get to the actual archaeological site of Trey. That's where we are. Very busy. <laughs> no one here also. I wish, it looks like they used to let you go up in it. That's cool. COVID. That's how big it was? I mean, it wasn't anything, remember? We found out oh. that it really wasn't Well, if it was, real. it'd be that big. I guess, yeah. I mean, it has to fit all the good warriors, right? We were amazed by these ceramic water pipes from like the Roman times that were watertight enough to deliver water to the cities that have been found at the in Troy. And then these huge holding vessels. They're just lying here. It's so crazy. We did read not to have too high of expectations for these ruins because they're very ruined ruined <laughs> so we shall see so this is that city you guys this is where they dug it up wow isn't that crazy Okay. And it talks about an altar. I think it's that middle Yeah, that was a recreation. Of an altar? Yeah. Did they say it was an altar? I think so. Woo! It's Come hard on. to tell when it says where the things Mom. are, or maybe this is the altar. Mom. I don't know. Yeah. Or that maybe actually. Yeah. When you have too much history. Just leave it in a leave it in a pile on the side. All right, we 
spent some time at home getting some homework and work done and hung out for a little bit. And now we are going to go into the actual town of Chonacale, which we haven't even seen so far. And we're going to go have some dinner and see what there is to see. So this Trojan horse was used in the movie Troy. And then they donated it to the town since the ancient city of Troy is here. And so it's displayed in downtown Chanakale. It looks cool though. This one looks like really like wooden and cool. Yeah. Start? No, I think that's the horse. Oh yeah. And Let's I think it. that's them trying to battle from the outside. Those are the walls. Yeah. And then the horse is trampling it. That's the inside. A good idea. I've said, Ollie, do you want to hear what it is? What I think it is? I guess, no. Oh, I believe it. And then it looks like a reproduction of the different layers of the tray. Yeah. Pretty cool. Like what we saw earlier. Yeah. All right. Did you pay? I paid. And so you did. Come back and we need the key in the car. Okay. <laughs> And so you did. You left the rental car keys in the car. Yeah. Just want to get this on. And I paid a guy. <laughs> you paid someone to steal your car. Got it. You saw other people's, other people's car keys. Car. Yeah. I feel okay about it. I'm sure it will be fine. <laughs> Two hours later. <laughs> I'm sure that. I don't know. I gotta have something to read. It's a pretty clock. clock. Um, is that Claire's cold and she's hungry. <laughs> she's hungry. And it's time for her to eat. And it's time for her to eat. And she doesn't want to go shop, shop shopping <laughs> or look at clocks because she wants to eat. <laughs> Yeah. That guy's so nice, he's translating for Mike because the lady had no idea what he's saying. People here have been so nice. I feel like Turkish people are going to watch this and they're going to be like, why did those people videotape and are equivalent of McDonald's or something? <laughs> what do you think? I think it's good if this is like a McDonald's or a chocolate plant. Hmm? Abs? Abs is eating it. Um, this one with chicken, so I think we told you guys how. We accidentally ordered three chicken. Uh, with Without chicken. anything else. Yeah. And they were pretty dry. They were dry. They were pretty meh. They are fine. And then these ones were super soft. So they were so good. They're gone. Yeah, the regular one was really good. Yeah, like we come back to get that one again, but yeah. not just chicken. Yeah. And they had fries and pickles. And Pickled peppers, it was very good. All right, let's see if our car is still there. If it isn't, I don't know. I don't know either. <laughs> let's just hope it's there, huh? Is it there? No. Okay, good. Yeah, they like move them. They move oh, yeah, them. it's right there. Good, because I just went All is well. <laughs> All is well. Thank you.